this question, we have uh, an object being pulled by an angle pull, and it's our job to figure out how much thermal energy has been lost when it travels a distance of 12 meters. Now, since all we're asked to find is the thermal energy, we do not need the entire um, conservation of energy equation. So we just need to remind ourselves that thermal energy is force of friction uh, multiplied by the distance that the friction operates through. And of course, force friction is force normal mu, and that's what we will substitute in the there. Now, what we need to do is remind ourselves that force normal, okay, with an angle pole, does change because of the force applied y here. So we do have force applied y. Okay, and of course, there is a force applied x that we will not need this time. Okay, so force normal is going to equal 80 times 9.8 minus 400 times the sine of 14. Okay, so, and this is because it's an angle pole and we're pulling up on the object, therefore force applied Y is pulling up. That makes the uh, surface feel like the object weighs less, uh, therefore that's why we subtract it. Now, if I want thermal energy then, most of the time I will solve for this expression here before I go to the conservation of energy. But since I have just a little bit to do, I'm just going to go 80 times 9.8. I will subtract again the uh, 400 sine of 14. Now I'm going to enclose that in a bracket there because that's my normal force. Now mu is 0 0.20, so I'm going to times that by 0 0.20. And then I'll finish up by multiplying by my distance 12. So my force of friction is all of this, which is my normal force, multiplied by mu. And then all I do is uh, multiply that by distance to get that into thermal energy. Or we can say that's the work of friction. Say 